question number 171 choose the incorrect statement with respect to AIDS and the very first statement says AIDS is a congenital disease and this is an incorrect statement and is the correct answer to our question as AIDS is a deficiency of immune system which is acquired during the lifetime of an individual indicating that it is not a congenital disease. Now let's discuss rest of the options. The second statement is retroviruses such as HIV have an envelope enclosing the RNA genome and this is a correct statement so cannot be a correct answer to our question. As you can see here in this diagrammatic representation of HIV you can see that this RNA genome is enclosed within an envelope. The next statement given in option 3 says in AIDS there is always a time lag between the infection and appearance of symptoms and as it is also a correct statement this cannot be a correct answer to our question. In the last option the statement given is AIDS has no cure, prevention is the best option and as it is also a correct statement this cannot be a correct answer to our question because AIDS till now has no cure. So the correct answer to this question is option number 1. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 172. Transmission of HIV generally does not occur by and the options are sexual contact with infected person, sharing clothes and utensils, sharing infected needles as in the case of intravenous drug abusers and the last option is transfusion of contaminated blood. And we know that HIV or AIDS is not spread by mere touch but only through body fluids. So option number two, sharing clothes and utensils cannot transmit HIV. So this is a correct answer to our question. Whereas sexual contact with infected person can transfer this infectious virus. So this cannot be a correct answer to our question. Sharing infected needles as in the case of intravenous drug abusers can transmit this virus. So this cannot be a correct answer to our question. And the last option, transfusion of contaminated blood can transmit HIV. So this cannot be a correct answer to our question. So the correct answer to this question is option number two. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 173. When the retrovirus enters macrophages, RNA genome of the virus replicates to form viral DNA with the help of and the options are transcriptase inhibitors, TAC polymerases, reverse transcriptase and proto-oncogenes. And as you can see here, this is a diagrammatic representation of replication of retrovirus. When this virus infects normal cell, such as macrophages, which act as host cell, this viral RNA is introduced into cell and this viral DNA is produced by reverse transcriptase. So the correct answer to this question is option number three, reverse transcriptase. Let's discuss rest of the options. The very first option given is transcriptase inhibitors and this cannot be a correct answer to our question because reverse transcriptase inhibitors or transcriptase inhibitors are class of antiretroviral drugs which are used to treat HIV infections or AIDS. The next option is TAC polymerases and this cannot be a correct answer to our question because TAC polymerases are DNA polymerases which are heat resistant enzyme used in PCR or polymerase chain reaction. The last option given is proto-oncogenes and this cannot be a correct answer to our question because proto-oncogenes or cellular oncogenes are present in normal cell but activation of these genes could lead to carcinogenic transformation of these normal cells. So the correct answer to this question is option number 3. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 174. Choose the mismatch with respect to cancer. And the very first match given is carcinomas and the match is breast cancer. And as it is a correct match, so this cannot be a correct answer to our question. Now the next match given is sarcomas and the match is bone tumors. And as it is also a correct match, this cannot be a correct answer to our question. The next option is leukemia and the match given is blood cancer. And as it is also a correct match, this cannot be a correct answer to our question. Whereas the last option given is adenoma and the match is lung cancer. And as it is a mismatch, so this is a correct answer to our question because adenoma is benign tumor of glands. It is tumor of glands. So the correct answer to this question is option number 4. Let's discuss our next question. Question number 175. 
typhoid can be diagnosed by and the options are enthron test vidal test mentox test and shit test now let's discuss these options one by one the first option is enthron test and this cannot be a correct answer to our question because enthron test is highly sensitive test for fructose so it is a test for saccharides and not for typhoid the next option is vidal test and this is a correct answer to our question because vidal test is a confirmatory test for typhoid which is a bacterial disease the third option is mentox test and this cannot be a correct answer to our question because mentox test is a diagnostic test for tuberculosis or tb and the last option given is shick test and this cannot be a correct answer to our question because shick test is used for the diagnosis of diphtheria diphtheria so the correct answer to this question is option number 2 let's discuss our next question 